huddled in the lobby of Ramsey Solutions, along with a few of our other listeners and viewers, in the snowstorm of Nashville, <laughs> which, by the way, is about an inch deep. But <laughs> Nashvillians think it's a foot deep, but it's not really. Is Alex from Washington, D.C., stopping by to say hi. What's up, Alex? Hey, Dave. How's it going? Better than I deserve. How can I help? Awesome. So I have a question about um, paying off some debt that isn't mine. Um, I personally became debt free about a year ago, but my dad has a parent plus loan to the tune of $55,000 for mm -hmm. my education. Mm -hmm. And so my question is, do I pay that off just now? I've been saving up money. I don't know if I should do my personal fully funded emergency fund first, or should I go ahead and just knock out the debt before I move on? Um, why are you paying off his loan? Um, he defaulted on it immediately when I graduated about seven years ago. And yeah, I gave him your book for Christmas last year, but, you know, what can you do? So he's broke? Yes. Okay. Um, so the loans, but your name is not on the loan. My name is not on the loan. I'm was, not the, um, was the loan, when you guys did the loan, were you aware of it, and did you have a handshake that you promised to pay it or something like that? No, I think his intention was to pay it. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. It's just he's not able, he's out of right. control, he doesn't handle things well. Yes. So you feel like you want to do this for him. Yes. Okay. Um, well, uh, let's kind of think through this a second. H how old are you? I'm 28. Okay. Um, I don't think you've got any moral obligation. You right. certainly don't have any legal mm -hmm. obligation. This is really an act of generosity is really what it amounts to. Um, and so you've got a great heart. It's mm -hmm. wonderful that you want to do something to help your dad, and he did something to try to help you and did it wrong and got right. himself in a mess and he's probably got a bunch of other mess, and it's mm -hmm. probably still going to be a mess even if you pay this off and so forth. So I'm not sure it really even helps him much because he's probably got enough other stuff going on right. that's bad. Um, so it's an act of generosity, and generosity is typically, other than a, a tithe, if you're an evangelical Christian Orthodox Jew off the top uh, to your uh, to your house of worship to your local church um, other than that generosity is done from surplus sure and so you would definitely get the other side of your emergency fund and start your investing in other words I think it's a good idea and I, I'm with you I think I probably would want to do it I, I I'm can connect with your heart on that, mm -hmm. but I'm not in any hurry. Sure. The The other part of it is I do have a pretty good income, so I didn't know if this What's speed, your income? I take home about 175000 You're killing it. Thank awesome. You. What do you do? I'm actually a boudoir photographer. Wow. Yes. Well done. Thank you. Awesome. Well, that helps. That right. does that does enter into the equation. What that means is you're going to be able to have that surplus exactly. faster. Exactly. Okay. So, yeah, let's get the emergency fund in place. Get the 15% baby step four mm -hmm. going into your retirement. Right. And then above that, if that's one of the things you want to do as an act of generosity, you can probably do it in about a year. Okay. Cool. And, um... I was thinking, I don't know why, I'm just, I, that's wonderful. And who knows, your income may even go up from there. It, yeah, it should this year. I also, st I have my retained earnings in my business, so I kind of, I, I kind of feel personally that I have that emergency fund already. And okay. at the end of February, I should have enough to just wipe it out. But I didn't know if I need a personal and a business emergency fund or. Like, yeah, you, you should have both. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, but, okay. um, uh. Because we want the, the emergency fund for the business is not purely emergency exactly. fund. It's used for growth and other things as well. In your case, maybe equipment purchases yeah, and, and that I, kind of employees, thing. employees, yeah. Yeah, and making sure that, you you know, in a down month you can cover cash flow and that kind of thing. And then your personal emergency fund, obviously, is for personal. But I do think, you know, within 24 months, regardless of what other stuff we put on this income, you're still going to be able to get to the 55. Yeah, agreed. So you're, you're going to be right there. And... Um, that would be nice. I, I, if I'm you, um, it's a very difficult conversation to have with parents yeah. when they're misbehaving uh, with money. But I would attempt, if you can sit down face to face, it's always more productive to put some strings with this gift. Mm. I'll pay this off if you'll go through Financial Peace University. Yeah, that would be, I would love if he would do so that. So that, you know, and, and I, I'm going to try to help you, but I, I otherwise, Dad, I kind of feel like I'm throwing good money after bad because it's like I can't fill up the hole faster than you can dig it. That is a great point. You know, and so I, I want to help you. I want to see you win, and I'm grateful for all you've done for me as a dad and for the helping my education and all that. So I want to pay this off, and I'm sitting here with my checkbook, Right. I'm going to send it direct to them, by the way. Oh, exactly. And, yes. uh, but, but, but 
You know, the only thing I ask is is that you agree to go through Financial Peace University. If you'll do that for me, I'm going to write this check. Right. Or something like that. I mean, just kind of play it where it's not too harsh. Mm-hmm. Like we're smacking him around or something, <laughs> you know, because he's not going to take that probably. But but if we can guide him and get some get some good for him out of this, rather than you just kind of over here on the side knocking stuff out. You know yeah, what I'm saying? I completely agree. So Well done. Thank you so well much. Well done. Good for you. Thanks for dropping by. Thank you.